Hey, what's up, guys? Mr. Free Coiner coming back to you again today. I hope everyone's doing well and you are taking care of yourselves. So, <clears throat> guys, a lot is going on. Um, but, uh, but, you know, before I get started here, a couple things. First, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm simply sharing my thoughts and opinions, so please only take it as that. Two, yes, this is a different format, and I just want to do something different. Um, you know, honestly, I, I kind of feel like what more can be said, guys? If you've been following everything uh, up to this point, you already know XRP is where you need to be. Um, and, uh, you know, there's really nothing more to say. I mean, there's partnerships coming out the wazoo. There's more and more stuff. At this point, guys, it's just a matter of what? Being patient that is my mantra so what i thought i would do was something that i really enjoy which is i love space sims this is called elite dangerous um and i have been actually a member of this uh community or game or however you want to put it for several years actually so uh yeah and and i just man i just really enjoy it this one and uh, another one that I play as well is, is called Star Citizen. I'm sure uh, if any of you any of you are geeks out there, you'll you'll know, and uh, I'm sure you'll you know kind of recognize this. But either way, uh, this is how I kind of sometimes unwind. It's it's uh, for me it's very entertaining. I I grew up in that age where Star Wars and uh, all of that, you know, where the technology had gotten to the point where the movies could look somewhat realistic. And uh, one of the, the, well, the catalyst that really got me down the road that I'm on right now as far as my love for this type of stuff was Star Wars. I saw Star Wars, the very first one that was put in uh, theaters, in the theater when I was, uh, uh, let's see, I was about six or seven years old. And uh, yeah, it just really, for me, started a love affair with uh, all things sci-fi. So <clears throat> anyway, enough about that. As far as XRP is concerned, guys, uh, now I'm not sure if you guys have seen Sam I Am's video, um, but uh, you definitely want to go ahead and take a look at that. It's, uh, yeah, it's, it's very, uh, very interesting. And I'll have to tell you, there are a lot of, um, there are a lot of insiders that are around, guys, and a lot of information that's being shared with many different people. So um, what you'll, you know, what basically what Sam is saying, I would have to say, I would have to really concur with most of what he's saying. Um, now, there are obviously, um, you know, differences and opinions and whatnot, but all in all, guys, the number one thing that we have to remember is just this. Nobody knows how high the price will go. And, uh, you know, nobody really knows when it's all exactly going to happen. Now, me personally, according to just kind of the things that I've heard, um, it's it sh there should be something that happens this quarter. OK, um, now. You know, anything can happen. Uh, you, you just really never know how um, things are going to turn out. You know, different things happen, which can cause delays. I mean, you just, you know, you just never know. But either way, I do believe we will uh, see something different this quarter, um, by the at least by the end of the year. So that's just my prediction. Uh, but. Like I said, guys, just never know. Um, anything can happen at this point. I, I personally believe, like I've mentioned about, uh, say, like Bitcoin. Um, I personally am not invested in Bitcoin anymore because I just, you know, when I look at the technology, and again, I am very much into the whole technological uh, aspect of crypto. Now, of course, I got into crypto because I want to make money, you know, and I've seen it. I've seen it happen. 
I know that it is very possible to, be to become very wealthy uh, when it comes to um, crypto. So, you know, it's um, it's a, kind of for me, it's a no brainer. And I'm sure you guys, you know, may feel the same way. But uh, also, again, I am very much into the technology aspect of it. So when I look at um, the difference between XRP and Bitcoin, it's just, you know, there's really just no comparison at all. Um, so I personally don't um, feel like I should invest my money somewhere, especially being that uh, the price is where it is. Um, the the uh, I guess the profit potential has already been kind of chewed up from uh, from Bitcoin unless you have quite a lot of money. You know, it doesn't mean that you can't you can't make a significant amount of money, but the um, possibility or the uh, inevitability of XRP getting to say ten dollars, and you know, from where it is right now, uh, you know, it's very possible, right? So if you have if you're buying at twenty five cents currently, uh, and you spend say five thousand dollars, you're gonna and you know when it goes to ten dollars. Uh, you're going to make a significantly larger amount of money than you would with uh, with Bitcoin. It's just that you know the the um, uh, the the how how much Bitcoin is going to slow down as far as in its profit potential is you know it's very very close. It's it's going to slow down, and this is just what I believe. Not to mention the technology is just not there. But you know I'm just rambling, guys. Um, you know when it comes to spending your money. Hey, you got to <laughs> you have to make your own decisions. So uh, anyway, um, guys, uh, I guess my main thing here is I just want to let you know, just be patient. Uh, we are in October. Swell is coming up. Um, there should be something very, very big um, talked about or announced during swell. Um, and, you know, I'm sure we can all, I mean, just, you can kind of read between the lines, all the stuff that's being um, released in uh, <clears throat> on Twitter and, you know, out there, it, it's, it's pretty evident that we are going to see some, uh, some major changes or just some, some uh, major advancements. I'll, I'll say in, in, um, in the price and whatnot uh, here very shortly. So, so anyway, guys, I mean, I just wanted to, Hey, just provide a little bit of encouragement. You are doing the right thing. You're in the right place. Um, and if any of you who don't like XRP, hey, that's fine. That is so absolutely fine. Just, you know, if, if you have a, a, a comment to make where you feel like XRP is just, it just sucks or you don't like it or whatever, all I ask is that you be, um, just be um, <clears throat> respectful as you are, uh, you know, leaving your comment. You know, don't disparage anyone or uh, it just is not necessary. If you, if you feel like Bitcoin's the best, you know, why are you listening to an XRP video anyway? I mean, it just doesn't make any sense. So anyway, guys, um, that's really all I had for you. Uh, I, I don't know, again, if you guys are into uh, uh games yes i am a an uh almost 50 year old guy and i do play video games but again like i said i am a space sim type of guy um and uh definitely my love uh you know i, I was again at the very beginning of um of this uh, of the uh technology or or rather you know the the video game phase that we are going to right now uh very different you know, times back then going, coming from an Atari to this, I can tell you right now, if I had ever, 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 I don't know why the edges are seeming so fuzzy. Uh, I'm going to have to go in and make some adjustments, but either way, um, I can tell you right now, if I had had the uh, opportunity to see something like this when I was uh, getting my first Atari and I know, you know, it, it, things, it, it just, I guess, um, if I was able to see this back then, I should say, I probably would have absolutely lost my mind. Um, yeah, I mean, this is something when I when I played my first video game, I guess, you know, I've always had the type of mind where 
I was thinking very, you know, I think very far ahead when it comes to uh, uh, stuff like this, but really anything I've, you know, I think I've mentioned this, but I have a couple patents. Uh, well, I have one patent and uh, others that uh, I have considered applying for, but uh, again, I, well, actually I did apply for another one, but I did get one patent. But uh, anyway, guys, like I said, this is all, uh, this has been all I had for you <laughs> this this evening. Uh, what time is it anyway? Yes, I think it's evening. Uh, but um, just wanted to, like I said, share some um, inspiring words with you. Um, guys, we're very close, very, very close. And uh, no matter what you end up doing, if you, you know, sell out, if it hits $5, you know, again, that's all your decision. There's no right or wrong answer. Um, you have to always do what's best for you guys. So uh, anyway, thank you for joining me, guys. Until next time, this has been Mr. Free Coiner. Take care of yourselves and God bless. Oh.